Hello, it's Amanda from IDPN, the I Do Photographer Network. Today I'm going to show you how I remove distracting elements from the background of an image. I'll be doing this today using the patch tool. In another video I'll show you how to use the same technique to remove blemishes from your subject. So let's get started. This is our uh, model Mona um, and it's a great shot with lots of beautiful light but it was a busy day in this park and so we have some mystery people over here and a road cone and so we want to remove all of these background distractions. We're going to use the patch tool today. The patch tool lives over here on your toolbar and it may be hiding under something else like the healing brush tool or the red eye tool. You just need to hold down that icon and scroll to grab the patch tool. So we're going to zoom in over here on our mystery people. Now the, the patch tool works by blending together whatever you initially lasso and a secondary source. So for example we can lasso around this guy here like so and then we click and drag that over to something we want to use to cover that spot. But if you get too close to an edge Photoshop will try to blend together whatever is is a is over that edge, like the teal above the light green right here. Um, and I, I don't know if you can see, but this there's this little half moon of teal that's fallen into this space. So instead, what we want to do is actually go into that edge when we lasso, like so. And then click and drag and find another spot that matches that same edge. And we want to make sure that those lines match up. And then when you let go, it will blend more seamlessly. So we're going to do the same thing with this guy right here. We're going to go up and through the teal and the purple and down into the light green all the way around. And then match those lines up again. And then he's gone. We're going to do the same thing with our road cone. Whoops. Road cone over here, up into the purple, through the teal, down into the light green. And he's gone as well. Just, just like so. So that's all for this tutorial. I hope you learned something and be sure to check us by subscribing to our channel or by visiting our resource library in the blog listed in our description below. Thank you again from IDPN, the I Do Photographer Network at www.idophotonet.com.